doesn't want to bring me on because he knows the whole thing is BS. Dude, what the? You know what? Fuck it, I'll do it. I've gotten DMs from 13 individuals about stuff related to this. I'll just say that. Yeah, because okay? 5,000 people are watching. What do you expect? <clears throat> well, every piece of information I've seen to present to you has been 100% on the money. And as we've rolled on more wait, What do you mean 100% on the money? Well, wait, wait. These, these are sources that are, like, a lot of these things that we've shown are, like, sources that are true. But there's your interpretations that I disagree with. No. What wait, happened I was don't you with intentionally your... hid things in I the beginning of this I didn't intentionally hide anything. Whatever I heard, or whatever I think I heard, is irrelevant, because I have no evidence that sexual harassment ever occurred. Regardless if I thought I heard something inappropriate, the proper thing to do would have been to bring it to his attention directly immediately after the incident and reach an understanding. Yeah. Dude, I hate to pull this card, but my mom was a homeless resident in DC. I give a whole lot of a You hated, but you did it. You hated to do it, but you did it. You didn't have to, but you did I'm it. Going, I'm going to. Exploiting people. I'm not exploiting your own fucking mom. That's pretty, pretty, pretty sad, man. Uh -oh. Everyone was covering Wick and Dylan earlier today. Does somebody have like a time stamped link? That's absurdity. That's the guy I wanted to talk to. That's absurdity. You want to talk? We can talk about it right now. Let's do it. Because this is the most bad faith. Bullshit. Come on, man. Yes, hop in the stream waiting room. Oh, are you in my sh Discord? Is that what's going on? No, you're in... Are you in the flock? Or what are you, like... What are you in? I'm in your stream waiting room. Are you? Let me go back. Maybe I clicked the wrong thing. Oh, you are in my stream waiting room. Okay, let's talk. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Give me a sec. Let me mute the stream so I don't get an echo. Okay. Okay. So, where do you want to start? Where do you want to begin? Um, How I'm using the suffering of others to profit. Well, sure. There's always a risk for that, right? Like, even in the best faith scenarios, even in the best kind of situations, there's always a risk when you uh, cover the, the trauma of others that uh, you're going to, is going to be exploitative. I don't, I don't say that necessarily that you are going to intend to do that. Um, however. I, that is kind of what you said in the tweet, yeah. though, isn't it? And, and yes, but I, I want to start at the beginning. Um, and so, even if it wasn't for your past actions, I would have uh, issues with this um, thing. I would have issues with any Twitch streamer or any um, uh, just uh, Joe Schmo out there. Uh, just uh, so you guys know, to, uh, 1, Poland, bits to name worse, the cat or, uh, Ukraine or dog or next adopted and, animal um, trying to get after you uh, from people. Uh, when people go through trauma, uh, there is a very good chance um, that if you do not pro approach it correctly, uh, that you are going to re-traumatize the individual. And that is um, something that, that uh, journalists have to account for and they're trained in in a lot of cases. Not all cases, obviously. But this is something that, that happens um, a lot and is something to be aware of. And honestly, I do not think you are. I could be wrong, but I do not think you are. Um, second point is because of your past actions and because uh, I believe, uh, and as I've seen, uh, you've exploited others in the past. I feel that it is only right to be able to call you out and say, hey, if this guy exploited others in the past before, he's done this before, then there is a greater than average chance that he might do so again. And people who are war refugees are in a very sensitive position where they are easily able to be exploited. That wouldn't be true if they were just some average Joe Schmo down the street. Okay, so the first thing I want, before we get into either of those things, I just want to say, 
that you are in this tweet accusing me of using the suffering of all these dead Ukrainians who are dying, being blown up by artillery, rocket strikes, uh, some of them being starved to death in places like Mariupol, etc. And these refugees fleeing the conflict that I'm exploiting them to profit off of them through subs and donos got to make sure they like and follow and sub yes. while he's yes. out there interviewing yes. refugees. Do you have any evidence whatsoever, anything contextually or anything whatsoever to oh, read that on. as my intent? Uh, again, based on your past, uh, your exploitation of other people's sexual okay. assault uh, okay. and how you've used that sexual to uh, bully other platforms. Uh, let me finish. How you use that to bully other people's uh, platforms and to hurt their, uh, to hurt their streams and, uh, and yes, because you've done this in the past, mm -hmm. there's a very real possibility you will do so again in the future. It's, I I can't read the future. Damn, dude. I, I could Don't be totally cat. wrong, but I think that it is worth calling you out and ringing the alarm bell, if you will, and saying, look, this is a situation that has happened before. You know, maybe, uh, maybe he'll do it again. Maybe this is something we should be concerned about, especially when there's much better ways. If you wanted to help these people, there are a hundred better ways to do this. First things first, what sexual assault did I profit off of? Uh, the whole, uh, I, I don't want to relitigate it, but the whole... No, you're, of, you've, you already opened it. Number one, no, yeah. number one, mm -hmm. it had nothing to do with sexual assault. It was sexual harassment. Sexual there harassment, is, there is a gap. Enough. There is a you're right. significant I missed, gap I misspoke, there. but in the tweet, I did say sexual harassment. Okay, I just so the first thing, I can I also it. say, you've got multiple facts about the situation wrong, okay? The first, I disagree. You didn't even let me say what you got wrong. So first, how did I leverage my power as her boss? Well, that's the power dynamics at play, right? When you were someone's boss, there's just this Okay, uh, when natural... was I her boss? Because I was never her boss. She never... I sh I ne you were her landlord. You were, She was staying at your place, correct? She paid half the rent. I paid the other half. Okay, we were just but, roommates. But you we, were the one no, that owned it, that, right? But that's, right? that's bullshit. Yeah. That's bullshit. You don't the thing think is, so? because if I own the property, but we're both just spending half, there's no way you could tell me that that's just by us. That you didn't have any that sort of leverage over her. In this no, situation? I think, but are you, you say, but how that? did I? How did I leverage are you, are, it? Tell are you me, saying that? tell me how I leveraged it, because you said I leveraged my power as our sure. landlord. Mm -hmm. How did I do that? Uh, so again, uh, as I understand it, um, you were the one that pressured her to come forward about these claims, correct? That's not true. You don't, you don't think that's true? That's not true. I know that's not true. I okay. lived it. Okay. She wanted to go on the biggest possible platform. Yeah, uh, you were her producer, or she was your producer. Sorry, she booked she was... three panels as a favor. Yeah, but she she, she was your your producer. That's right? no. That Not sounds, yes, that sounds that, like bullshit. True. No, that, that, you're that fucking bullshitting. Three okay. panels as a Fair favor enough, is a boss. Right? Is that what that yes, is? Favor, when no. I think boss, I think of employee and employer as if she's getting paid i never paid her she booked three panels as a boss a lot of people has if anything she would have she would be the one doing me the favor how do i leverage her doing me a favor as a benefit did she get paid for this she never got paid i didn't give her a dime never got paid. Okay. no she booked three panels as a favor i was like hey i don't have a booker right now uh you're good at that can you do that for me quick that was it. And I leveraged that? How did I leverage that? Well, you were in a position of power over her. How? Through leveraging? Again, the boss she thing. was staying at your place. She paid half the rent. It was roommates. And I didn't leverage it in any way. You made the accusation that I leveraged it. Did. did I ever threaten to like, oh, I will kick you out if you don't come forward? You're making it sound like I put a gun to her head and said, if you don't come on my stream, I'm going to kick you out of my fucking apartment and you're going to lose your job. It, it oh, does whoa, sound whoa, like whoa. that. It because you called me your boss. Be you called her. You called me even her just boss. A natural, even just knowing the natural power dynamic between the these two natural people, power dynamic. Mm -hmm. The natural power dynamic. So the natural power dynamic of me being her boss and what that really means is she booked three panels as a favor. I never paid her a dime. Or me being her landlord, what that really means is that we were roommates for two months. Most of the time, by the way, she was in Europe. She wasn't even okay. here. How could I have even leveraged yeah, that power? But not all the time. Again, when not she was all there, the time. she stayed with you. Yeah, she as stayed a roommate. How did I leverage it? By the way... Proving this doesn't prove that I leveraged the power in any way surrounding the situation. Okay. How did I leverage it? Again, 
It just looks really bad. I don't I'm care if it right looks now, bad. It looks Fuck really optics. I do. I don't care. I do. I don't care. I do care about that optics. Has nothing... I do care about how it looks because it goes in because whether to how it... things played out. God. It goes in oh to how God. things played out. What you did was wrong. It was dude, unethical. I, dude, it was dude, exploitative. Dude, dude, dude. I, it was exploitative. You used someone else's trauma in order to attack another streamer who you were competing with in oh, order bullshit. to destroy right. his platform. This oh, is what yeah. happened. These are the facts. These this are not the occurred. facts. These are speculation. You're speculating now. You're speculating that my intention was to destroy Prime I am was extrapolating my on the data which no, we what can data? see with our eyes. What data? What actually happened. Oh my god, what data? You made accusations, they were fucking wrong, mm -hmm. and you had to walk those things back. You did not and vet so, your sources, you did not, even mm -hmm. giving you the best faith possible uh, interpretation, it See, shows that you should really not be doing any it fucking journalistic work because you don't know how to fucking vet your sources. Look at this guy. So this you made a never, false accusation, one, you hurt another person, really you uh, destroyed... Uh, someone else's career look you took food from their mouth i destroyed their, their career table. i didn't do okay number you one took they still food from stream. their table oh my god how can you not see this is a terrible thing what oh. okay number one fuck you for trying to straw man yeah, well, like that fuck you too no literally i don't like you fuck okay you because you're being i don't a like you either you snake. you're being a scumbag right oh now oh, I, you're oh, dragging oh, this, this thing out that's completely sir. this is completely unrelated and this is why you are not a trustworthy individual this is why you are not a trustworthy individual in order to because you Fumbled the ball. You didn't. Fumbled you didn't know. You don't have any preference. You, have, uh, no you have no evidence. You have no evidence. You are speculating. You have no evidence that I leveraged I any of these things. Of you have you no evidence that you leveraged any of these things. You don't remember anything about the situation. It was her idea to come on my stream. Okay, let me just put that out there, by the way. Wow, you, uh, this is a really but you're bad just, look the thing you, is, I've no, I don't care if it's a bad look. Fuck optics. Okay, I what I did was wrong. I've admitted it at the time after everything came to light. I didn't do it properly. I've admitted that and I've apologized. But you dragging this out while also getting the facts out wrong months later, right? To try to leverage it against the trip so I can interview refugees is scummy. Definitely Yo, when not you're not definitely shut up. Like, I need to finish. You are Let, me finish. Add to this Let me finish. You're not getting the facts right that's the first problem and this situation is basically completely unrelated this is just you trying to turn this into a dunk for something that happened eight months ago which was terrible but is unrelated to the situation in in, in poland and in, in poland and ukraine whatsoever okay completely unrelated are you finished can i respond sure okay so of course it's related because when someone does something exploitative when someone hurts people like you did it is natural and probably wise to assume that perhaps we should look out, out at this behavior in the future, that it might be a problem in the future, that perhaps because you've done this in the past, it is more likely, not a certainty by any means, that you will do so in the future. And all I did at the end of the day was call you out on it on Twitter and say, hey, I think you're pretty scummy for doing this. And I stand uh, by that. Okay, so... Do you walk back the leveraging of my power as a no. boss and landlord? Okay, so no. you're just gonna stick into that, even though you got that completely wrong. Okay, uh, like, are you again, gonna walk I, back I that that I, I made her, or I, it was my idea to get her on stream? Are you gonna walk that back? Uh, you know what? I'm not as certain about that, so I might. Mm -hmm. I might. Okay. I might walk back that one. I'm not got sure. It. So, um, but can but we just, I will give can we, you grace in that one. So let's clarify that boss meant that she booked three panels as a favor. Okay, boss. That's. Amazing boss relationship. Honestly, if I would have stopped, could have gone homeless if I stopped employing her in that manner, right? And landlord, which meant that the apartment that I have was in my name, and she lived with me for two months. The majority of the time she actually did live with me, she was off in Europe frolicking around in Sweden or Finland or any of these places, right? So for the majority of the time she did live with me, she didn't even necessarily live with me. And the rest of that time, she then lived with her parents, right and so for about a month to maybe a month and a half she did live with me and she paid half the rent and you have no evidence whatsoever that I ever i don't Wait, I, do yeah, you i'm not evidence? accusing you in a fucking court of law what evidence do i need to well, say no, hey, you have no this is what i saw happen. i'm leveraging something this is what i saw how did i leverage my, my status the as the owner of this and apartment? hey i could take evidence how did and i, I leverage can look it? at it and i could say oh wow how hmm, did i leverage it how did happened. i leverage my ownership of this apartment when we were paying 50 50 
split Yo, down I, the middle. How did I leverage that in this situation? I wasn't in your house. I don't know. You don't know. So why did you say that I leveraged I it? I know that you were in this position of power. So it's very likely that you may have. Kat claimed that Prime wow, used his power over goes. her. And she was really booking individuals for so him. So why wouldn't she? By the way, so you don't have any evidence. You're just maybe it's likely, I guess kinda because you don't trust me but you don't have of any evidence I don't trust and you. so you shouldn't say it if you don't have any evidence i suspect things no, all the time you, oh, i oh suspect things all the time but i don't say them out loud unless i have evidence i suspect there's a lot of streamers that are grifting or doing bad things or doing this and that and you want to know what i don't do definitely after the situation when i learned my fucking lesson is i don't come out and just make accusations i would think if you're criticizing me for making public accusations and fucking it up terribly eight months ago you would check yourself before you make public accusations and i'm making public accusations right now because again this is what you did this is what this happened. isn't you just said you don't have evidence you just said you don't have evidence that i le that i leverage this stuff you just said it you're gaslighting me man i'm gaslighting you, you. are gaslighting I'm gaslighting me. you by you have showing no you evidence for any of this friend. By what happened, my friend? I, you, you again, you, have, you're like, standard no evidence. for evidence. Your standard for evidence is so high that what, what evidence did I give you? That I didn't would even you. give you a what standard for evidence. evidence. I asked you, no, give me any. Give me any evidence. Give me any. Hey, hey, hey. Give what me evidence any. would convince you? What and evidence would literally, convince you? Literally. And I will provide it for you. Give what me, evidence? Okay. The evidence I would need is either some testimony from somebody or some statement or some text or something to show that I tried to leverage either my position as... A person taking a favor from her for three panels or the person that she lived with as a roommate but i had ownership of the apartment under my name that i used that to like push her to come forward or something when again it was her idea i am saying this is highly likely that this happened okay, so based on the situation evidence. No. I have seen, based Literally on the evidence not. of my eyes and my ears, the evidence of my senses, the evidence of the results of the uh, of what happened. I think Wick Wait, probably quick, should have you, a higher standard of evidence than this. Of course ears, not. He should have a higher standard of evidence. Of course what's not. Happening right now. I, I completely understand what's happening. I would have expected at least, you know. The thing is, you've got to understand, right? I, w I took my lashes. I want to take my lashes. I fucked up, right? But when months later, people are using this situation, which in my opinion, we can get into it more later if you want, is unrelated. I understand you disagree with that. But then you're saying things that are completely inaccurate to the situation. You could have just said, Dylan, because of the situation with Prime, I don't trust you here. Instead, you got into details that ended up not being true. And that's why I'm angry because it's frustrating for, for me to look back at this when you're trying to make a point about why it's it's bad for me to go to Ukraine to interview refugees and then you just drag out accusations you have no evidence of and now you have to admit you have no evidence of and the evidence you said is oh uh, I have vision I could say that if, about anything <laughs> if you recall when we first started this conversation if that is what we want to call it I said that even without any of that you going to Poland and to Ukraine especially to Ukraine uh would be a bad idea that there are so many other ways you can use your your uh, your uh, resources, which are abundant, that you can use to help these people that would actually make a much bigger difference. That I think you inserting yourself, that you inserting yourself into these people's lives and into their trauma in order to make a buck is probably not a good idea. But you're, you don't, again, but you, you're added reading, to you're that into is the addition that, yes, I do not like you because I think you did something very scummy. Oh, what? Okay. Very scummy. Feelings mutual, okay. by the way. I just want you to That's, know that. I, 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 okay. Uh, okay. No, I get it. But this is just an added layer to the problem here. It's, war tourism is not a good thing. It's not war tourism. I'm not going to the front lines. I'm not going to the war. I'm going to the place where the refugees are, and I'm asking them in advance, hey, here's what we're going to do. We're going to have an interview. I want you to know this is what I do for a living. This is what we would like to do. Would you be interested in this? Do you consent to have this conversation with me? And we can sit down and talk about your experience. If they say yes, then we sit down and have a 20 to possibly 30 minute conversation with them do you compensate them in any way um that's something i've considered and i would be um, probably okay i'd be open to it i'm not against it 
again. Like, what's so uh, wrong with that? Like, I say that out loud, well, and it well, feels yeah, so the, non-objectionable. But I, I told you the, what, what's wrong with this. Unless you're trained in how to deal with people who have experienced trauma, they're very likely to re-traumatize them, which will cause them immense yeah. amounts of pain, immense amounts of suffering in the future. This yeah. is a real problem. Well, the first thing, you don't know if it's very likely to re-traumatize them. Everybody's situation... It's much about. more likely me, than an average person. I'm sorry, my dog's barking. Give, give me one second. Uh, but yeah, uh, it's, it's it's much more likely than the average person mental... because there were, were there were refugees. Yes, there and that's refugees. why we're not just gonna walk up. I'm not gonna Logan Paul this shit with a camera like, hey everybody, there's a kid behind me. Their mom died and the bombs. Hey, how's your dead mom going? Wow, wow, wow. I'm not doing that, right? What I'm doing is I'm specifically going out and looking for people and then getting their consent to record them and have a conversation with them. And those people who agree to it are probably gonna be people who think they're up to the task and want to talk on a platform. And if they want to talk to the platform and I have the platform available, I feel happy to offer that platform to them if they want to do it. And Yo, you're going to Ukraine and you are difference. and you're looking at that Ukrainian and saying, no, you're there not is allowed a big to. Difference. There is a big difference for someone who reaches out to you and says, hey, uh, I've had this experience and I want a platform to share this experience. There's a big difference between that and then going to where they are at and uh, basically uh, canvassing them and harassing them until they're Harassing? They what do you mean? What, what, what is this turn from? I, hey, we asked them a question if they want to. It turn from that to you're harassing See, the refugees. Problem, you're though. going I to the refugees going ooga, booga, booga. <laughs> I just don't believe you. I don't believe you're going to do this right. Well, I don't then believe why do you care? Just wait correctly. and watch. Just wait and watch then. Don't come out with inaccurate what? information oh, about past traumas. Wait and watch till you do the, till, till you cause But you're saying I'm going to harass them, say, but you got no hey, evidence. Dude, this is probably my, a idea. Dude, I hate to pull this card. But my mom was a homeless resident in D.C. I give a whole lot of a You fuck hated, but of, you did it. You hated to do it, but you did it. You didn't have to, but you did I'm it. Going, I'm going to. Exploiting people. Oh, I'm exploiting your own fucking mom. That's pretty, pretty, pretty sad, man. What did you just say? Said you're using and leveraging your mom's experience, horrible as it is, in order to score a point on a fucking Twitch debate panel? That's some, okay, some number fucking one, shit, dude. This isn't a panel. I know all you do is Fair run enough. a panel ticket. Like this is a conversation. Well, this is not even a conversation. This is a yelling. This is a yelling exactly. thing. But at the end of the day, the reason I said that is I was trying to express to you that I give a lot of a fuck about housing insecurity and people losing their homes. Because the reason I got into politics in the first place is because my mom did dope and was homeless, and that fucked me up, and I don't like that shit. And that's where I got my trauma, since you care so much about trauma, right? And that's something I care about, and I share that information with you. I didn't mean to exploit it in a debate. If you don't give a fuck, you don't give a fuck. But that means a lot to oh, me, I and I care about I care. this. I do as well. And, and that is why like I have Earned, my friend, when you decide to go for the clicks, views, and subs to a like, you don't place know that you're just assuming intent. Again, I'm extrapolating based on what you have done in the past. But now you're the one who has made false accusations. It is highly likely. I am not saying for certain. Uh, I'm yeah. saying it is highly likely. Highly likely. It is likely enough that I felt justified calling uh -huh. you out in a tweet. Yeah. And, and then you got half the information wrong and can't defend anything. Oh, this is this is some some uh, you know next this level, is, this is next fucking level gold mental gymnastics. You've just won the gold fucking medal, dude, dude. Okay, so you felt okay. So do you want to go back to the tweet and we can go back to why basically half of this was wrong in the first place? You want to do this again? So the only time I've seen you do any reporting, you exploited someone's sexual harassment allegations. That's not number one. That's what mm -hmm. you've seen. What about my reporting on January 6th or my reporting on the protest following January 6th? I can't, I can't, I can't speak to that because I haven't seen it. Okay. But I can't see what I, I can't so speak maybe on what I have you, used. Okay. So maybe you should go look at that and tell me if that was Why? bad. Why should I? Because you're saying that I just use these situations for clicks, views, and information, or blah, blah, blah. It's all grifting. Number one. I'm saying you're going to use this specific situation. Yes. Yeah, but. These are actual situations where I've done reporting, I guess you can quote, I don't even like to call it reporting, but I've went out into the field, so to speak, and actually covered situations, which that's a lot more comparable to a situation where I was pertinently, personally, emotionally involved 
in with another individual my person who wasn't at the time my significant other but would become my significant other because i was romantically interested in them and those emotions and that stuff played into a disaster after i was misled with by people like samantha banana because then i platformed stuff that was unvetted but the dynamics of that situation are completely different than what happened on january 6th but, but you can happened. understand how i would have concerns when before when you reported on this uh these allegations and you didn't bet them you didn't do your due diligence you could see how i would have concerns and you i would have maybe a problem I, with you going on look, and potentially traumatizing these people again and potentially doing a lot of harm and heaven forbid you go to ukraine itself that that would now be, that you've uh, said that, that i'm be... there's like 50 percent more of a chance i'm gonna do it <laughs> Don't like seriously. I I, I don't I, care. The more no you say don't here? do it, the more likely I'm gonna do it. I'm no telling you that here? right that's, now. That's so dangerous, my friend. And, and I'm I'm trying to trying to like do not do not do that. Do not do that. Swipe or no it's swipe. So dangerous. Swipe or no swipe. Are, are, are is that is this the level you're gonna do? And I'm saying, hey, this. I don't. When you dude, go I into don't, potential I don't, active I don't war respect zones. Respect your opinion. I okay. have talked to people who know a lot more about this than you, who are advising me on how to do it in the safest way. Possible. I'm going to trust them. If they believe it is safe, then I will do it. If they say the situation on the ground is currently not safe, then I won't. That's why I've not set made a promise on going into Ukraine or not. I trust them much more than you. And since you expect, and since you respect expertise, um, definitely when it comes to trauma, apparently, uh, then you expect respect their expertise here. I assume. Yes. Okay. Wonderful. But I don't trust you to. Uh, again, you say you're going to do this. But that's that's the crux of the issue. I don't think you will listen to this. I think you're just going to do whatever the fuck you want. And that is my opinion. That is what I think. That's what you and think. And yes, you can you say, well, you can't prove it. Well, yeah. And that's true. I can't prove it. But uh -huh. I can spout off a little bit on Twitter because, again. Well, by the way, do you, again, do you see the irony of you criticizing no. me for not vetting information while you're putting out incorrect information? Uh, again, I do not believe my information. So how did I leverage except my for, power? Except for as a landlord. Except for maybe a, again, maybe the fact, and I don't think I said this in the tweet, but I, I did say this here, and if I'm wrong about this, I will own up to it. That you you were the one that pushed her to go forward. I might be wrong about that. I don't but, think I said that in the tweet though. You didn't say it in the tweet. Yeah, of course, but okay, you said I leveraged my power in, in these yes, different you ways. Did. Mm -hmm. When at the t again, I believe you did. I think it's highly likely. Literally that you every did. single one of these are wrong, and there's no evidence to support it. There's none, and you say there is, and I'm like, okay, what is it? And then you say my eyes, and you've got to understand why I don't. That that sounds like bullshit to me, right? Because I saw this go. I I saw this play out. I the, tuned well, into then do you do you have any? Is there any clips? I mean, I, I know the stream has over. Into the, the stream the, the, has the, over the three hundred thousand views on YouTube. Track. It is a massive stream where people where I got took the biggest L of my fucking career. I'm sure if the clip exists proving that I leveraged my my status as a landlord or as a boss. Or as a significant other, there would be evidence of that. You shouldn't have brought and personal somebody stuff would be able this. to link a clip or something, right? Do you understand that we weren't in your home? That we weren't. Um, when I, I said I should say I, I'm sorry. I wasn't in your home. I wasn't in uh, in these calls, and I can only trust your word that you did not do this. That is that is all I can do. You can but say that's nothing. The thing. That's I the don't other trust option. your word. If you don't trust my word and you don't have any evidence, then you can just be like, I don't know. No, nah, I, don't I have think the this evidence. is. I I have enough circumstantial evidence to say, okay, yeah, this guy probably did it. Yeah, uh, I can't prove what's it for the, a fact. What's, what's that's the true. circumstantial evidence? I can't evidence. Prove, it, prove it for a Let fact. Let me hear that again, next. Uh, so again, the fact that you were in competition with Prime, so you. How was I in competition it. in Prime, by the way? I'd like to hear that. What do you mean? You're drawing from the same pool of viewers. Okay, so. The thing is so if and again look at his uh look at his uh, Amazon Lily panel you destroyed uh, that there's a lot of people who just because of your and I say you know what I know that's interesting the thing is I so the thing is I built up Prime by being a founder in his community by constantly raiding Prime you built by, him up uh, yeah wait wait wait, wait. Uh, taking shut, credit shut for up. his work I'm not, okay I'm not taking credit for his hard work but it is a fact that I had a founder's bad in this community. I raided him after the end of my panels because he was another panel host and I wanted to see the other panel host succeed. I mean, maybe you could say I was like just gassing him up or some shit, but I did that, right? Is that wrong or right? That I did raid Prime a lot. No, after... I, 
Okay. I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know how often you rated him, but okay. I believe he. If, okay. I'll, I'll stipulate let's, let's, let, let's say let's say it was even a small amount, and that I had a founder's manager community. It wouldn't make sense for me to raid the person, interact with the person, go on his show as a panel host, do everything I was doing, when. I'm then worried about competition and then wanting to take out the competition. By the you way, saw an opportunity, my friend. And this is how it works, okay? So you see this happen. You, you do all the things you do because you don't know if you can take him out. So obviously, you play along. But when you see an opportunity, you took it. And that's so what I believe you did. I, I, I rated him under the auspices of one day taking him out. I got a Not founder's... necessarily. You didn't know you were going to do that or not. So at the time I was good Dylan, but then I got corrupted by what the do you greed mean, or good something. Good Dylan versus bad Dylan. Like, yeah, well, it's like, like, well, it's like at one point. Dylan. So at one point this I was rating him Dylan. for like to like have him have more viewers. When and, like, it made sense with him to you to do it, to, like, you did it. When well, it how? But it doesn't. But it stop. doesn't make sense. It doesn't make business sense. Apparently, there's more to the Wick versus Dylan stuff. How? Where? Like, but you don't think someone expressed a valid concern over that platform? Well, I think that is a valid concern, but I think that the way you brought it is not is the like. It wasn't like a concern. It wasn't someone raising a concern. It was an attack. It was like oh, uh, you're not I like... definitely did attack him in a couple of ways, but it's because I'm concerned. And not there are other tweets other than me who definitely do not bring this as attack, but bring it as a concern. So I just want to like dig into this because like we we all agree that Twitter is a toxic space, and I think getting feedback off of Twitter can be challenging. The fact that we're having this conversation right now in this panel talking about this is an indicator that we're all here in good faith. We could like use a measure of charitability here to like you know try to understand everyone's points and like try to like you know build the best bridge we can while also acknowledging that there's like some severe differences between all of us on some level. Like, I think that's fine. Um, yep. So in terms yeah. of interviews, we've kind of like nailed that one, right? Like for me, like what I think is important and not to say that my preferences are like, there's people who are like, we say disagree with me on this and uh, yeah. How are they getting informed uh, consent? How are resources available for trauma victims? Do they know what empathetic listening technique is? So the, like, the, uh, oh, I'm a lot of are you reading chat by the way? Yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. So you see all those questions. Okay. And those, like, those would be good questions to ask, right? To answer. So basically your method of avoiding taking out a slot from refugee is to just pick something that's like so pricey that there's no way it would be housing refugee anyway, basically. Yeah. After that, it's not really a matter of anything, you know, but like, it's like basically, yeah, like so, our requirement made that like, like, how can they maintain informed consent? What is it? Will they have a trauma expert available with them? <laughs> they're acting like they're acting like all of these people are like like fucking like you know <laughs> just, like some of them sure gonna be fucked in the head obviously but it's not like every single one of them is gonna be like you know in fucking blankets like oh my god you know it's like there's gonna be some people there that just realize shit was getting a bit fucking whack and they fucked off jesus christ what the fuck the people who are going to take this place fuck could this take shit, like any other place other places are available you have security uh, uh... Like, because you realize that, in, in, in especially in a place where there's housing a lot of refugees, and especially if, if, if uh, you're going to be uh, going among them, um, that there is a high likelihood that these people are in desperate situations. Like, crime rises in these cases mm. just because of the thing. So you're going to need uh, security uh, just for your own safety um, and for the safety of those around you. What, in Poland? In fucking Poland? What? We're talking about fucking, like, a mainstream European country. What the fuck? It's fucking Poland. What do you think's going to happen in Poland? We will go on holiday to Poland. Jesus Christ. I do not believe that you have thought this through enough. I think that there are better ways to go about it. I think there is value in getting the stories of individuals who have gone through these things. But I do not believe that what you are the, uh, I, I, that I think is that I think Wick has... Um, in general are the best ones I to think, do that. I think, I think Wick has a grudge. Um, I think he has a grudge. And I think it's coming out in this. That's what I think. Is that, is that a good enough thing for me to say? Does that make sense? I think I think if he if his grudge weren't overwhelming the uh <laughs> um if his if his grudge his preconceptions weren't overwhelming his emotions, I don't know, maybe he would be able to express these things a little bit better. I I understand that a lot of people are upset with Dylan for what happened with Prime. But, like, what spoke to me when I was, like, talking with Dylan one time is he said, you know, he's, like, there's no way, like, there's no amount of times that I can say that I fucked up and that I um, I shouldn't have done what I did um, that's going to make what happened, like, right, you know? Um, and that's true. Like, you're going to, like, especially if you're, like, kind of in the public eye, there's definitely, like, we're all going to make mistakes and there's going to be no amount of apologizing that's going to make it better. While it was a really bad thing, I don't think it's fair to forever hold this over him. Um, I think what's more beneficial is if you're really, like, I don't know, worried about 
like prime being successful you know you do what you can to like be positive and help him that way you know I don't think he deserves all this like heat and I think that I think that Wick has a lot of I think Wick is very protective of Prime. I think the anger um, around it is is misguided, and I think he could have had a much more like productive conversation. I understand, like I understand the risk. The argument that you brought, I brought them too. Like going, like uh, talking about going to Ukraine for me, this is nonsense. Like I really hope that like delight isn't. That, that, that was what, like, like uh, besides wait, anything like, else, that is what made me the I think the most upset is him just this spiteful little oh because you told me I wouldn't do it, I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm like, dude, you're gonna you're gonna yeah, get but shot. That's Dude, you went so fucking. Dude, you're right. in fucking Poland. Who the fuck is gonna shoot you in Poland? Oh my fucking god. You know what? I want to show up to one of these. If they're still arguing about this tomorrow, I'm gonna just call in randomly and be like, I think he should be really careful in Portland. And I'm just gonna keep leaning into Portland. And people keep will, will keep telling me Poland. And I'm just gonna keep saying Portland. Once you realize it's Poland, just flip 100%. Oh sure, he can go to Poland. Poland's neat. <laughs> but Portland, you have to be really careful in Portland, okay? Doing the exact opposite. <laughs> if you were, you'd listen to Rizm, You just got on here. Well, let me be very clear with you, Rizm, right now. What you're doing is is is, is just fucking oh, brainwashing. No, no, this like, is about it's not a, shit. It's okay. Oh, it's very okay to have that fucking criticism on people who have done this poorly in the past, Rizm. Uh, He's done this poorly in the past. And because he has done this poorly in the past, what has he done poorly in the past? Maybe you don't know. No, can we not? someone. Maybe you don't know. We were so fucking close. He falsely accused having. No, 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 no. I don't want to get into No, don't do it, Wick. Why are you doing this? Wick, don't do it. Okay, I want to get the fuck out before this actually starts. Let's just talk about the important shit. He keeps bringing up Dylan's past, and that's just not... Why would you do it a second time, Wick? Why, Wick? You know better than this, Wick. What's going on here? Done this poorly in the past. No, 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 no. Maybe you don't know. No, can we not? Maybe you don't know. We were so fucking close. He falsely accused having. No, 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 oh. no, no. I don't, really really now. Now. Holy I, shit, I don't okay. want to get into this whatsoever. This like, is important. I'm, I'm so okay, glad that Matt left. Let's just talk about the important shit first. Yeah, this, and then we'll this, talk about the other stuff later. Like, like, so, like, the so, like, the important... Matters. So, so, the part that is actually relevant is that, like, I'm asking questions that are interesting about this fucking trip. It's more interesting than fucking figuring out... It's more interesting how much concern you're doing. No, it's actually more interesting than fucking Dustin. It's more interesting than covering a random drama on your fucking streams. It's bullshit. Did you Did you guys listen to the fact that... Have you taken any notes since Mad Lad and Wick started telling you what you should be concerned about? Have you written anything down that you need to actually be concerned about? Right. One actual concern is the embassy. The U.S. embassy has shut down its American like welcoming center, right? Which which, which is actually like a logistical concern, and that's something that you guys might want to plan around. Um, and, and and I would recommend that you probably file a float okay. plan of some kind Fair with enough. the embassy. Keep in touch with them while you're there in case shit goes south, or at least Dylan should. Um, uh, because like there's a number of things that they can do to help you out in in Who's the case of revolt? emergency. You know what I mean? But like, other than that, like Godspeed, I think you guys are gonna be fine. Uh, Poland's a Poland's a fucking uh, like you know a first world country by all standards. Like and, and there's no battle going on there right now. And in fact, there's like seven thousand U.S. Marines there right now doing uh you know practice drills and like helping with the refugee situation it'd probably be really interesting to talk to some of those yeah. guys too see this is decent yeah. um this was yeah, decent for him to say embassy, i think yeah, that was pretty good i will look uh, into this before we go yeah yeah so, if, if you but... shoot me a dm and or, or have dylan and I, I have some some phone numbers and stuff already lined up for you guys if you want them that's pretty cool yeah uh i reach out to you after that but i just wanted to to go back on one thing uh mm. My biggest problem with this shit is that, like, all of your concern is, like, okay, do you know the situation in Poland, basically, my lad? What's happening in Poland when it comes to refugee, all of this shit, how they're handled, if there's, like, refugee camps, if there's, like, how it's going? As far as I know, they are basically turning every available space they have that's not, like, a, basically, like, all cement structures that have space available uh, are being turned into a place for Pol uh, Ukrainians to stay. So, like, most of the time, it's, like, hotels, like, dormitories, et cetera, et cetera, right? I don't think there's any actual camps in Poland, as far as I can tell. I've done, like, you know, the search, like, refugee camps Poland, and I haven't seen anything yet. That's not to All say right. that it's exhaustive, but, like, as far as we know, that's what's going on. What about food? In terms of food, as far as I know, uh, there's still plenty of it, but there are, like, humanitarian supplies coming in, like, from, you know, international sources to help contribute. So, like, yeah, it's yeah, probably yeah. okay. We don't know. Right? Like, everything, it's all about unknowns at the end of the day. There's, like, a lot of things we don't know. Like, you guys, like, as far yeah, as, like, we in two know. weeks. Yeah, I yeah. agree. We yeah. don't know. And that's my main thing. Like, yeah. y you understand that, like, like the, the starting point, like, the information that you have, and, like, even, like, where, like, you guys took, like, this thing is, like, 
there's such a leap that like i don't know how you can cross that i don't know how you can like have this concern about this trip and say that they're funded reasonable or anything well i mean you understand that like my my concerns about the trip are different from like wick's concerns about the trip like wick is saying no, that you shouldn't do it all I know, but and then my clear. point I is i want to be clear that oh. like uh Wait, Mad Lad well, is trying yes, to be clear first. We can more about that right now. But let's let Mad Lad finish his clarity first, Wick. Fair huh? enough. Fair enough. Okay. Well, I mean, for me, like we have contrasting opinions. My opinion, I'm just going to specify what mine is, which is we should ask questions and then figure out if uh, you know what logistical concerns can come up, and then see if we're right about it. At the end of the day, that's it. Like, there's no reason for you to feel attacked. I'm not directly attacking the trip. I'm just questioning everything about it because it's interesting. At the end of the day, what should you do when you're planning a trip like this? Right, and That's then it. you start from the fact that there are concerns. Right, so I'm and talking then you to Mr. Come up with random concerns, <laughs> and then you walk it back after the fact. You I didn't walk anything back, Mr. Oh, wait, oh, I'm sorry, Rhizome. Yeah, oh, I'm I wonder to Mr. why Geek. Mr. Geek is saying that your sounds just as hyperbolic as uh, your point sounds just as hyperbolic I'm, as I said. I'm sorry, it probably is. Rhizome, shut the fuck up. I'm listening to Mr. Geek. I, I actually disagree with Rhizome. Stop trying to act like a fucking giga chat. It's not working. You've been soying out over this whole fucking thing. Nobody has any fucking respect for you right now. You are, dog. You really fucking are. You I've heard more about people not having respect for you than whatever the fuck this. Oh, so more people. I'm in more people's mouths. Than you are. It makes a lot we of sense. Okay, great. You it are. doesn't matter. I'm not. In, I'm not. Well, oh okay. no, not, guys! Why do you have to do is. this? Like, oh, Don't be. We this is petty. This is petty. Well, like, just, just whatever. Like, fuck off. Let me talk to Mr. Geek, and then we can like sort our shit later. Like, whatever you're doing here is like. the moderator here, dog. I'm in the room for a fucking reason. God, dude. Men, men create so much drama with each other. Don't ever let a man tell you that women are so dramatic. Okay. Look at this shit. It's a male-dominated hey, sphere. Man, All these motherfuckers are creating drama with each other. You don't ever people. fucking what tell a me. Fucking liar, ever. Dude. Again, I will never I listen do. to anybody ever tell me again that women are more dramatic than men. I have worked in all all male offices and all female offices, okay? Guess which one had more drama? You're right. It's the one where all the men were taking their dicks out and swinging their dicks every time we had an office meeting. You know what? I'm going to say it. it. I'm going to be sexist. What? I'm going to be sexist as fuck. Sometimes I really think that women are better than men. I mean, the naked female body just looks better than the naked male body sometimes. A lot of the time. Women are just better. Why do men commit 80% of the violent crime? And why, why, why in the fucking office do men always want to do the dick swinging content? I'm tired of it. Come talk to me after you've bled every month since you're like fucking 10 years old. Do you know what it's like to start bleeding at 10 every month? It's terrifying. You think you're gonna die. Hake was saying that woman brain men are evil and that women are doing the evil things and, and eating the apple from the Garden of Eden. I bet, you know what I bet? What gender was the serpent? Tell me what gender was the serpent. You're going to tell me that 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 it was it was the woman's fault for eating the apple. No. What gender was the fucking serpent? What does a serpent look like? It's a penis. Okay? It's a penis.